this guy, a uh, 32 year vet, just retired, uh, uh, sheriff. And this is what he gave me. He says, look, at this stage, it doesn't make any difference what happens in November. We're still going to have a revolution. It doesn't make any difference. We're going to have a revolution come November. I don't think Obama's going to leave office. I think he's going to try to create enough. Yeah, I think he's going to try to create enough turmoil to, you know, and Trump get assassinated and Clinton get indicted, you know. If he does create a he says he's going to well, but that's the deal. Yeah, but that's the deal. He would need the complicity of the military and the police. And they're not going to go along with her. No, they're working. I mean, 80% of them were telling me that someone, if they give the orders to come and take our guns, they're going to kill the people who get the orders. So, it is. It is the truth. Well, thank you, thank you. Yeah, but military person go up to there, I'll choose military. Well, I'm ex Marines. Ex Army. Well, you can't. But here's the problem. You can't sit down on this one because this is all about. This is anything. This is about. Uh, about you want to have globalists take over a one world government, or do you want to have us be a sovereign nation? Sovereign nation. Well, this is what Trump said at his acceptance speech. Americanism, not globalism, will be our credo. So this is it. If anybody but him gets an offer, and we got to show up because they don't want him in. You've got to understand this is an age-old battle, long before any of us were born, to get this final brick in the wall. If they can bring down the United States by installing Clinton, it's over. We will never see another election again that would, it wouldn't be. It was supposed to be Clinton against Bush, and we were all supposed to be, ah, shit. We are get so fed up, we were stayed home. But Trump came in with his own money and trumped them. He bitch slapped 16 of them out, the yeah. opponents out of the way and the Pope. Yep. And he still stayed it against every one of these guys lining up against him. That's true. That's true. So you gotta vote. You can't sit this one out. I don't care if you swallow it. If the man's got warts uh, all over him, he's still better than Clinton. You have to get out there. Taking taking money from us. Well, we gotta show up in force. It can't be a landslide. Now, one, we gotta make sure we get to see an election because there's a good chance to pull a false flag on us before that. I mean, just the other day, Comey came out and said, Comey, the son of a bitch that just let Clinton off, right? Well, Comey just came out the other day and said, expect to have another attack bigger than 9-11 soon. That was him. These are the same bastards that did 9-11 to begin with. So when they come out and tell us, oh, oh, yeah, there's going to be another one soon, uh, you yeah. know. So what if there is? What if they nuke a city? All of us said, oh my God, martial law, where all the energy Walter grids Hall. are going down. Who knows? Martial law is in effect. Nobody walk around. Nobody walk around. Military, ex-military will be pursued. Obama will stay in office. They cannot change the president if we have martial law. Now how close are we to that? Back close. Oh, some places have already become martial law. Thank you. Some places have already Thank become. Thank you. Some parts of this country, as you know, are already given up. Right? Texas one got their day on federal gold. Mm -hmm. They got enough. They said we're the Texas the first ones to be attacked. Yeah. We, uh, they all lock guns because we we will fight before we yeah. let go our guns. Well, would you guys succeed? I'm coming. Don't Texas, shoot. Texas is trying to succeed, yeah. and they've got the money. Yeah. They got the backing. They have, we have power plants. There's three power plants in the United States. One in the East Coast. One in the West Coast. You got the resources. You can be your own country. Oklahoma, well, Alabama Alabama went and got some of it. And who, what Obama did? He shut all the federal. Weapons. The federal gold, you can't go get it. Yeah. No, we have been taken over by foreign entities, and it's happened a long time ago. Where they are, so it's the last thing they're doing. This Trump has screwed them up. He wasn't supposed to be here. Thank you, sir. Have a good one now. Be careful.